Okay. Uh, let's see. So we're done with this. Right. Our wing's still down. Yeah, I, I don't know. I, I like this game. The, the characters, the story aren't that interesting, but it's fun enough that I can look past all of that. Like, there are some games where there's, like, some glaring problems, and it, like, really dries, draws your eye to them. The only thing this game is guilty of is overprice. Electrum shipment just came in from our prospector friends. It's it's overpriced, I think, Unknown for what it ship. is. Divert course oh. immediately. I'm conducting very important research and don't have time for visitors. Dr. Thorne? Fox here. Fox McLeod. We're from the Equinox. And I believe you know our captain, Victor St. Grant? Of course. This is incredible. How is he? St. Grand is... gone. I'm sorry, child. You must be devastated. Please, come straight to my outpost. We must talk. I believe destiny has brought us together. Years ago, St. Grand and I began a project that could destroy the Legion for good. We parted ways before we could complete our research. For the sake of Atlas and the galaxy, you must help me finish it. Guys, I think we should help her. Didn't St. Grand ditch her way back when? I know. But what if Thorne's right and we can stop the Legion? It's worth the risk. Dr. Thorne, we'll help you finish your research. You've just taken the first step towards saving the galaxy. I'm sending you the coordinates of a swarm artifact that's taken me a century to find. I call it the Keystone. Dr. Thorne, St. Grand and I have been searching for my species for years. How did you locate the artifact? You brought the swarm specimen with you. Judge is the whole reason we came to Atlas. We're trying to take him home. It's a fool's errand, and I fear you'll regret it. Hey, how can you say that? He's one of us. One of you? You have no idea what they're capable of. <sighs> Please, understand. The swarm are nothing like our species. They are more like locusts, an unstoppable, destructive force of nature. If they're so dangerous, why are you even trying to find them? Because the Swarm hold the key to all our futures. That weird armadillo creature creature was not having me. It was uh it was mad about something. I don't know. It's confusing, to say the least. The vines have trapped a large chunk of debris. To get to the artifact, you're going to need to clear it. Those pods govern the vine's growth and are laced with potent neurotoxins. You must remove them. This cave system holds the keystone, but it also holds danger. These vines are far too toxic for me to get close. I've already taken the liberty of scanning your ship. Your shielding should keep you safe. Sweet! It's like gardening. With jets! I find it amazing that you and Saint Grand are the same species. Aw, thank you! Am I supposed to get in here? Can I just go in? So I can. So I kind of can. There we go. Okay. Analysis. The Nova may be more easily dislodged if targeted with cold weaponry. Weapons having no effect. I have cold weaponry. Hey guys, I'm a little freaked out. I mean, you don't really think that judge could be dangerous, do you? Levi. You are aware I am on this frequency, correct? Oh, um, sorry. Don't be sorry. 
I'm worried too. How much do we actually know about it? The way's clear now. What? What? Why is the rock just randomly floating? Okay. I am confused by this, but sure. You did it! You recovered an actual swarm artifact. Uh, for a species of short-lived mammals, you are capable of great things. Watch who you're calling a mammal. Being here with all of you, it's like he was here too. I see facets of his personality in each one of you. Except for Levi. Hey! Now, bring me the artifact. The fate of a thousand worlds hangs in the balance. I bet we're probably gonna have to fight her. She's gonna immediately attack Judge. Space races. Excellent Space work, blood Equinox. Blood. Now place the keystone on top of the central structure. Bringing the two elements together will unlock the power hidden here for so long and show us the way to the swarm. Is it Mason, I am concerned. What if Dr. Thorne is correct and my species is a threat? I'm not afraid of you, Judge. Maybe you should be. If I harmed the Equinox, I could not forgive myself. St. Grant saved me. Without him and this crew, I would be lost. There's a jumping puzzle in my spaceship game. No, damn it. Wouldn't be so bad if it wasn't the only jumping puzzle in the entire game. Oh right, I forgot I can slow fall. As long as I've got juice for it. There we go. Mason Rana, I am curious. What did St. Grand tell you about me? Funny story. He didn't actually mention you. Ever. Uh, how strange. He often told me about your world and how beautiful it is. I hope to see it with my own eyes someday. What's your planet like? My home world was once like your Earth. But now it's a desolate wasteland. What we're doing here today will stop the same thing happening to your world. Incredible. You've made it to the top. I'm in a spaceship. What's going on? I was right. I was right. After so many years, a swarm scout ship. I only wish St. Grand could see this. Picking up an energy surge, guys. A big one. I can hear the ship. It is beautiful. Sounds like singing. Are there swarm inside? This ship is empty, but it's reaching out to contact the hive mind. The signal's off the charts. It's a burst transmission, and it's aimed right at Necrom. That can only mean one thing. There's living swarm on Necrom. Meet me there as soon as you can. We are so close. More of my species. This is why St. Grant created the Equinox. Please, we must go to Necrom and find them. Necrom. I don't think they've actually updated my uh, quest marker here. But that's okay. Did you get it, Shell? Weird. It's supposed to be sending Shell a. Uh... Oh, you know what? I think I. Supposed to be sending her an uh, uh, image. Legion readings are moderate, but they can hide anywhere in that fog. Stay sharp. Okay. Uh, let's see. So we 
we we have our objective. We know where we're going. We're going up here. I wish the. <laughs> okay. The flying chops are not so hot here. I. I'm kind of surprised for a planet called Necros. It's. There's not a whole lot of bone. Like, that first planet was covered in bone. Or I guess the, the planet we were, we were just on. And yet, for some reason, like, we get here and it's like, it was definitively creepy when the extractors were on and everything was all dusty. But now that we're here, it's like, not actually, it's real pretty. I don't, I don't, I could see like a layer of water above all this and like some big fish. But I don't, I don't really see Necros being a, uh, a valid title for this planet. Maybe that's just me. Kinda hoping we'd fly over a facility. I actually would like to fix up the R-Wing so I can actually fly it now. I'm shocked those projectiles were able to follow me. Oh well. Whoa, this place is a graveyard. I've never seen so many primes in one place, and they're all destroyed. What happened? There's Dr. Thorne. Let's ask her. Welcome to our destiny. Can you feel it? This is where everything changes. What happened to all these primes? It was the Swarm. The Wardens once owned this planet. Then, the Swarm came for their Electrum. The Wardens tried to protect their harvest, but it didn't stand a chance. The Swarm have the ability to merge with the Nova in the Legion machines and possess them. The Legion wasn't fighting the Swarm. It was fighting itself. Equinox, this is it. Live swarm energy signatures. And they're coming from inside the head of that central prime. Everything is falling apart. How are we going to get through that armor? We're not packing that kind of firepower. Uh... But these primes are. We can use their own lasers to punch a hole right through to the swarm. Excellent thinking, Mason Rana. I can see why St. Grand chose you for his expedition. You sure it's not his hair? Yeah, Mason's hair is pretty great. I like how in zero G, doesn't even move. Pretty sick. Can we just focus on the mission, please? Uh... These primes still have some juice left in them. Plug that focusing crystal into one of their tails. Is this... We just randomly have jumping puzzle time now. Okay. Where do I plug? This tail? Oh, there it is. Whoa, imagine two primes fighting it out. I have seen it with my own eyes. How old are you? Old enough, child. It's so weird that they just add jumping puzzles to this specific section. You know, in retrospect, it could just fly, but I'm betting I'm supposed to actually... Oh... Uh... Let me guess. No crystal. There's a crystal here. It, it's just so weird to have this this whole set of mechanics. Good news. Electrum shipment just came in from our prospector friends. This whole set of mechanics for jumping. Okay, I've got a lock on Necrom's Prime. Updating your star map now. No. Oh. Try that one again. Problem is, my spaceship has got some oof to it. A little bit more than I thought, actually.
That actually makes it easier to traverse. Because, yeah, I don't actually have to go up these tails. Nope, 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 nope. It's mainly just once we hit the ground, we have this, like, hefty s speed boost, and it's like, no! You freed the core. Now, bring it to me so we can collect our reward. Guys, I've got a bad feeling about this. This is our chance to defeat the Legion. We should finish the mission. Sorry, Chase. We're giving her the swarm. Can we not? When the Wardens first arrived, they claimed they were explorers. They gave us a taste of their amazing technology. Tempted us with a bright future amongst the stars. But it was a lie. They took our culture, our freedom, and started stripping our world of its raw electrum. They crushed us under the Legion's heel. Then one morning they were gone. There was no warning, no explanation. They just vanished. My people celebrated their newfound freedom, but I could not. The Wardens were gone, but there was nothing preventing them from one day coming back. Every species has a weakness. I crossed the galaxy searching for something to use against the Wardens. It was on a string of barren worlds that I finally found my answer. The Swarm. All I needed was a live specimen, and I had almost given up hope on ever finding one until I met Saint Grand and Judge. With the amount of Swarm we have found, I could save a star system. With Judge, I could save the galaxy. Give Judge to me. I will take the swarm, find the wardens, and destroy them. No. Judge isn't a weapon. You heard, Mason. The answer is no. If we handed Judge to you, we'd be no better than Grax. I haven't toiled for centuries to be stopped by you. You have no idea what life was like under the Wardens. Well, let me give you a taste of it. Why are they attacking us? Why are they so angry? They are not angry. They are afraid. They have been locked inside a prime core for centuries. They think they are still at war. Destroy their Legion hosts, and they will retreat back to the Prime's core. What then? I will attempt to reason with them. It's working! The Swarm retreats back into the core when you destroy the Cyclops it's possessing. All the Swarm's back in the core. You must Starlink the Swarm to the Equinox. That's taking some big chances. What if they possess the ship? The Equinox is our only way home. You're wrong. The Equinox is our home. I trust Judge. We're doing it. I will absorb the swarm. They will become part of the collective known as Judge. Memories emerging. We came to Atlas, hungry for Electrum. No. The Wardens attacked us. We fought back. We feel regret at the conflict. We have become judge and are finally at peace. So the swarm, so many of them. They were here in Atlas. But now, who knows where they are? These few members of the Swarm are proof that my species is still alive. We will find them one day. But where's Thorn? Where'd she go? She's gone. Escaped when we were dealing with the Swarm. Then we track her down and deal with her. <sighs> She's probably halfway out of the system by now. Sorry, Mason. I know how you feel. You never forget your first betrayal. 
We'll run into Thorn again. Hey, if it makes you feel any better, I managed to track down the coordinates of the last data canister. Don't know if that's something that interests you, but I'll send you the coordinates. You know, just in case. And I won't even charge you for it. Which planet? Great. Sweet fast travel. I'm so glad you can just insta fa fast travel to planets. Admittedly, I didn't figure that out until, you know, I'd already wasted some time flying from planet to planet, but whatever, I'll take it. Attention, residents of Karit. Your time has come. I am Tak Vega, and I am here to take the trade sector for Grax. Hey, does that mean we have a new, uh... Behemoth? Yes? No? Is that just a weird radio message from the dead? Karit, here I come. The Legion's presence is slim amongst the dunes. It won't stay that way, though. Closing on the last canister. This is it, guys. We've seen everyone's dossier. Except mine. Right. Do you want to listen to this alone, Mason? No. It's okay. Let's hear it. Equinox data recovered. All Equinox canisters accounted for. St. Grand personal log. Subject, Mason Rana. Mason is a brilliant young mind. He's achieved more in his first 20 years than I did in 40. I used to tremble at the thought of what awaited us in the stars. But then I met Mason and saw that he had no fear of the unknown, only hope. He will succeed where I once faltered. The Equinox is one small ship, one small family in a vast and dangerous universe. But with Mason's optimism, creativity, and enduring faith in his friends, we will never be alone. I... don't know what to say. Yeah. And we miss him too. But at least we have each other. Thanks, Levi. That was really nice. Mason? Yeah, Shade? Don't let all that brilliant hope stuff go to your head, okay? Is that it? Are we done? I get stasis armor for that. You're looking heavy with cores there, pal. Bring him here. We'll help you unload. Seriously? I just got some armor. I just no unique mod. I mean the the hey there. image cutscenes were kind of neat. No sweat. We'll have you patched up in a jiffy. Well, all right. So that leaves us with just the main campaign. We're almost done. So we want to go back to Tundria. For a couple of reasons, for starters, I might as well take out that uh, prime. For secondaries, uh, we actually haven't found the wonder here. I'm gonna quickly scoot over. It's gotta be. It's gotta be revealed at this point. No. Really? Yeah, I'm not seeing it. Okay, because I want to find the, uh... And I'm actually gonna... I'm gonna put one right there. Uh... I want to actually find the, uh... T -t 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 the wonder before we finish this game. You know, get all the interesting, important stuff done first. Then we actually, you know, finishing it, finish everything off. Because pretty much once I actually start working on the, uh... The end of this game, we'll be done with it within, like, half an hour. I'm glad that the uh, the side missions were actually worth doing.